Hey there, spiritual seekers! Today, I'm diving into the fascinating world of protection spells and wards. Whether you're looking to shield yourself from negative energy or safeguard your space, I've got some powerful techniques just for you. First up, let's talk about the basics. Protection spells are like energetic barriers. They can be as simple as a daily affirmation or as complex as a full moon ritual. The key is intention. Your focus and belief are what make these spells effective. One of the simplest methods is the white light visualization. Close your eyes, take a deep breath, and imagine a brilliant white light surrounding you like a bubble. This light acts as a shield, repelling any negativity coming your way. Now, let's get into wards. Wards are objects or symbols placed in your environment to protect a space. Think of them as your spiritual security system. Common wards include crystals, herbs and symbols like the pentagram or the Eye of Horus. For example, placing a piece of black tourmaline at your front door can help block negative energy from entering your home. You can also draw protective symbols with salt or chalk around your space. These symbols act as a barrier keeping unwanted energies at bay. Feeling a bit more adventurous? Try crafting a protection jar. Fill a small glass jar with protective herbs like rosemary, sage and lavender. Add a pinch of salt and a few drops of essential oil. Seal it with intention and place it in a spot that feels right to you. Remember, the most important element in any spell or ward is you. Your energy, your intention and your belief are what empower these tools. Trust in your abilities and the process. You've got this. So, there you have it. Now you know how to cast protection spells and set up wards to safeguard yourself and your space. If you found this helpful, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe for more spiritual tips and techniques. Stay protected and stay magical. See you next time.